This is our video to introduce the do's and don'ts when we begin to regather in our community now groups, all right? Now, today we're all going to be acting a role, all right? So let me introduce to you our actors today. Playing the role of the greeter and host will be Ashley Twitchell. Playing the role of the person who is compliant and is doing the right things, Sam Coates and playing the role of the obstinate person who's not always doing things the right way, but they have a big heart, is me, all right? Now, if we, we will be wearing masks on Sundays, but for the sake of this video, Ashley is gonna be doing a lot of speaking, and so she's gonna have her mask sort of tucked up like it is right now, so that you can hear her, all right? So, let's get to it, take one. Hey Sam, welcome to Community Now. Good morning. We've got some markings out throughout the building that help us to honor safe distance. So if you ever see a marking, please make sure that you say a safe place apart, okay? okay. We're glad that you're here and I see your mask. What does it say on it? Be kind, wear a mask. Be kind, wear a mask. Great, thank you for honoring our covenant together. Here's our hand sanitizer. And as you come in, the doors are all open. We ask that you gather to the right as you go into the sanctuary, and there'll be another host there to help you find a seat. All right, thank you. Thank good you. to good see you. Hey, John, it's so good to see you. It's good to see you, Ashley. John, do you mind standing on those markings over here for me, please? We're trying to maintain oh. some safe distancing just to make sure that we're respectful of each other. Even here? Even here. We're really trying to keep each other safe okay. and show each other how much we love you by keeping some safe distance. We're not going to be able to... We can do some air hugs. Uh, okay. We can do some That's good air hugs. That's That's you don't like hugs anyways, John. Let's just do an air hug. All right. So I see here there's a hand sanitizing station. I did that in the car. Oh, great. Well, there's some people in here who may not have gotten to see you do that. I saw you in your car. I know you did. But some people here may not know that. So I'd really ask you to do this. They've already done it in the car. Great. Well, let's um, share the peace of Christ by washing our hands. Okay. And there's a mask available for you, too. Well, now my hands are all wet. Well, you can take a minute. We can talk. How have you been doing? I've been doing all right. I'm kind of, you know, people keep telling me I need a haircut. I you really do think you need a haircut. haircut. Yep. And uh, it might help you be a little more friendly when you come out to have your haircut, too. Well, all right. Do I, now, do I carry the mask? It would be great if you could put it on before you enter the building. Oh. This is another way that we can love our neighbors and our community by keeping well, each other safe. Well, how can I see the mask on? Well, John, you should have read in our covenant that we won't really be doing any singing. We'll oh. get to share some fellowship so and some no conversation, singing? but we're not going to have singing for a while. Okay. It's just not quite safe. All right. As you enter, all the doors are open, and please go to the right, and there's another host that will bring well, I, you. I don't sit on the right hand side. I normally sit over on the left you hand side. You should have received the information in our covenant that talks about where seating is going to be safely marked. So oh. please follow the direction of the host. Okay. Welcome. As you come in and as you leave the sanctuary, the doors will be propped open so that you should not have to touch any surfaces. There is a hand sanitizing station available on the wall that you can grab a squirt on your way in or way out as you feel needed. And there's also a touchless trash can so that if you have any items with you that you've used in the sanctuary, please throw them away on your way out, cleaning the space behind you. Hey Sam, it's so great to finally see friendly faces. Thanks for maintaining social distancing as we gather. Follow me to your seat. We've marked the pews in here so there's safe seating as we gather with our friends. If you'll make sure that you find a spot that is marked, and once you're seated, please stay there. Okay, thank you. We'll continue bringing folks in, and we hope that you'll greet one another as you maintain your distance. Thanks for being here. Well, good to see you. Sam. It's good to see him. Hey, Remember, 
We're practicing some safe distancing so that you can love your neighbor and keep them safe too. So please sit where the marked spot is. Right here? Right there. Now you can feel free to talk with your friend. Isn't it great to see everybody? You good? You good? Can you hear me, Sam? <laughs> now remember, John, I know you've had trouble with rules. When we're dismissing at the end of all this, a host will help you out. So please don't just get up and run around. We want to make sure that we're honoring our covenant as we leave, too. So I can't just... Just be prayers. patient with us, John. Just be patient. It's really good to see you. Here's another air hug to help you feel better. <laughs> Thanks for joining us for a little how-to. And remember the do's and the don'ts as we begin gathering in Community Now groups. You'll receive a detailed covenant that has all the information you need about how we will safely gather, what the church is planning to do, and what we hope you guys will do together. So please don't be like John, and please do be like Sam and love your neighbor. <laughs>